So we have walked through every single bedroom of our house and I am so happy that I got this out for you guys because it made me happy seeing our new home to us. another video today I'm going to be sharing a home tour or a walkthrough of our house and I'm so excited because this video is a highly requested video so let's go ahead come on in let's go ahead and get started When you first walk in, you enter the entryway. I have a mirror right here, and I also have an entryway table that I got from Bed Bath & Beyond. And the mirror, I got from Hobby Lobby. All the other decor right here, I actually shared that in the hall with you guys. I'll have it linked down in my description box for you. But then over here in the entryway, I love the entryway, you guys. It's like my favorite, favorite part. So I have two shelves right here. I got these shelves from Marshalls, and I love these shelves because every season, I can change out whatever is in the shelves. And you know, spruce it up, change it up, you know, according to the season to make it fun. And then I have a chest right here that I got from Hobby Lobby. I shared this chest with you guys in the haul too. I just like to keep anything that I like to use throughout the day inside these chests, just to make it easier on myself. Whenever you walk over here, I have our gallery wall. I know it's only four pictures, but I will fill this up as time goes on. And then I just added a chair right here. I think that this is really cute. I think it goes well with the entryway. So let me share with you guys something about the entryway that I also love that I think is really, really neat. So there is two parts to the entryway. So you have the walkway right here, but then you also have a walkway over here. I think that is so neat. Okay, so let's keep going. I'm gonna go through the kitchen and then we're just gonna loop all the way around. The kitchen is just like a walkthrough area. It is pretty small, it's a lot smaller than the kitchen we had before, but we do have a lot of cabinet space and that's what I like about the kitchen. We have a bar area in the end. And we also have a pantry. You guys, we have a full, full pantry and I am so excited. I cannot wait to organize this pantry and share it with you guys because right now, it's not disorganized, but I'm ready to organize it. Get it looking cute. Let's go, and then our refrigerator is different. We have a double door refrigerator. So we have a bigger refrigerator. I feel wild show through. Oh, you're good. That's what they do on cribs. Like, <laughs> my fridge. Okay, so then when you, whenever you walk over here, you kind of enter like the utility room. I'm super excited to decorate this space. I want to do like a sitting area in here for Jake and I, and then like a place for the kids to play. Since we don't have a playroom, I think that'll be really cute for them. Right now it's kind of all over the place, but we'll get it together and I'm excited to share that video with you guys. So let's go ahead and keep on moving. We walk through here. So we're kind of like looping around if you guys can't tell. Jonah. <laughs> so right now we're in the dining room. The table that we have, we got from Big Lots. And then the bar stools we have, we got from Overstock. I am so happy with how our dining room looks right now because So when you walk into the living room, this is what you see. I'm so happy with the living room. We have the TV on the wall and we also have a sectional sofa. If you are a returning subscriber, then you already know exactly how I feel about getting new furniture. I was so happy and so ready for this. I know the TV looks so weird on the wall because the wall is so big, but we actually can't put the TV above the fireplace because there's not an outlet for us. So we have to keep the TV on the wall. We either have this wall to go with or we have the brown wall to go with. And since there is literally no other way for us to move this sectional, this is what we have to go with. But I'm 100% happy with it. There is nothing wrong with it. So now we're gonna go to the back of the house. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so when you go through the back of the house, here's the hallway. I have a coat closet right here. And then we have a linen closet right here. And I'm actually really happy about our linen closet because it is a lot bigger than our last linen closet. 
And this right here is just the front closet. The hallway is pretty small, but I really don't mind. It just feels a lot smaller. I feel like the hallway feels a lot smaller because of the brown doors. If it weren't for the brown doors, the hallway probably wouldn't feel this small. This is the kids' bathroom. We have a powder room area. And then over here, we have the bathroom area. And you can even shut the door, y'all. This is, to me, this is fancy because I just, I don't see houses built like this anymore. My grandma used to have a house like this. And it was like, I remember my sister, we would play hide and go seek and we would do stuff. So, y'all, this is beautiful to me. And right now we're in London's room. This room is a lot bigger space than she had before and I'm so happy. She plays in here. She does everything in her room and I did come in here and clean up. If you guys would like to see that cleaning video, I will have it linked in my description box for you. Other than that, this is London's room and this is how it's set up. I am really happy with how it's set up. So when you walk out of London's room, here's the boys' room. We have their bunk beds, they got a new dresser, and then they have their TV on the wall. We got the bunk bed from Big Lots, and then the dresser we got on Amazon. I'll try to have everything linked down in my description box. But I am 100% happy with how the boys' room turned out. They have a walk-in closet. London has a walk-in closet too. I know this room is a little bit smaller than London's room, and you would probably have expected me to put the boys in the other room but I actually want to put the boys in this room because of the closet space they really really needed the closet space but then when you walk across the hall from the boys room here's our room so when you walk into our room I did just do a video on decorating our room so if you guys want to see that I'll have it listed down in my description box however when you walk into our room we have our bed our sign our gallery wall the bench I'm so happy with how the room has turned out, you guys. It looks so beautiful to me. There is a few things that I wanna change in the future, but I'll get to it when I get to it right now. I think everything is perfect exactly how it is. Even Simon Cat House in the corner, you guys. His cat house is perfect too. So then over here I have my desk area. This is like my office space for right now. It serves many, many purposes. This is where I sometimes do my makeup. This is where I sometimes work. This is where I read my daily devotions. This is where I just do me and just live in my own little world right here in my own little bubble. It's just so cute. Okay, so I'm being a little extra. So over here we have our vanity area. This is probably my favorite thing about our bedroom, the vanity area, because it's just so cute. And then we have a bathroom. I'm really happy about our bathroom too because we didn't have a bathroom in our room before and it was so hard on us getting ready in the morning with three kids and one small bathroom. Now we have two bathrooms and it's a much bigger space than we had before. So, and then whenever you walk over here, here we have our TV area. And I put our TV stand in here because it is a much darker wood than the wood that we have out there. And it kind of makes the living room look a lot smaller. So I went ahead and put the TV stand in here and I think it looks really, really good. I may switch it out in the future. You never really know with me. Right now, I think it looks really, really good. Oh wait, one, one more thing. We do have a walk-in closet, but I'm not gonna share that with you guys because it is a mess. I am actually gonna start filming a declutter video in our closet so you guys will be able to see that. So let's go ahead and walk back to the front of the house. So that is it. Now we are back in the entryway. This home tour slash walkthrough is complete and I'm so happy that you guys came along to walk through our house and see every bedroom and what we have going on. It really does mean so much to me. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Fantasia. I am a wife and mother to three beautiful children and I post videos like this every single week. So if you enjoy content about cleaning, motherhood, lifestyle, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you don't miss out on any future uploads. Other than that, I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!